Hi everybody, it's Momo. I know what you're thinking. What the heck is she doing vlogging? She doesn't even vlog anymore. Well, it's because I feel the need to document my bravery and my courage because I'm getting ready to go into battle and I want my kids to see that I was fearless because today I'm going to war against stink bugs. Okay, now we're outside and the stink bugs don't usually come out until late afternoon. So, as you can see, my house is pretty stink bugless right now. Now. I'll let you see. There's there's one up there. Okay, so it's about two o'clock. I just got back from Target. I have a few different things that I want to try to get rid of these stink bugs. First of all, just around my front door very, very sparingly, like every other day or so, to keep them from seeping in um, the cracks around my front door because they were doing that and it was like a horror movie, uh, I sprayed this. I'm not for pesticides. I'm really not. See, I've had this for like 16 years. See all the rest? But um, yeah, that worked just around the front door a little, little bit. The next thing we're going to try is, uh, I hear that stink bugs are attracted to water, which is, is why I think that we have such a bad infestation right now, because we planted grass seed a few weeks ago, and we've been watering it every day, and now there are stink bugs everywhere. So we are just going to take a dish towel, soak it in water, lay it on the ground, and see if they're attracted to it. And if they are, and there are hundreds of them, as I suspect there will be, we're gonna dump them into a bucket of hot soapy water and then they'll drown. Sorry, but I'm not sorry. Um, the next thing is a, a trap that I'm going to build. You'll need a knife or box cutter, black duct tape, masking tape, a Pepsi bottle, plastic bag, and because we have to get rid of the Pepsi, you're gonna probably need some rum and nice. let's get started okay I just went out and laid the towel over the fence I saw a bunch of them there and they fly anyway so I didn't lay it on the ground I just put it over the fence so now let's go out and try this hot soapy water technique okay cheers okay I just came out on my back porch and before I could even get outside I saw one it's up here and there's another one over there I hear it. Oh. Okay, so let's go outside. And I will show you. Here's the towel. Nothing yet. It's only been a few minutes, though. Okay, so here's quite a few of them on my garage. Um, we're gonna we're gonna try this hot soapy water thing. Here we go. Okay, so I really didn't think it was working, so I went kind of overboard on the um, spray, as you can see, and it just kept crawling away. But then about 12 inches away, it rolled over and died. That's just hot, soapy water. I like it. I'm going to go kill a bunch of bugs now. Okay, so about two hours ago when I showed you the side of my house, there was only one, and I just looked up and I counted 20 of them. Yeah, so um, I can't obviously reach those with the spray bottle, so I'm going to go in and make the trap now, see if we can get some later this evening with, with my creation. <laughs> okay, so I, I cut the top off the bottle. I used the label as a guide, cut the top off then removed the label. Okay, so we've got this. Now we're going to take uh, our black tape and put it all around the bottom of the bottle.
I've got one little spot there that I'm going to cover. There you go. Okay. Next, we're going to put our little LED light in. Not on yet. Put it in the bottom. Put the top of the bottle here, like a funnel. And then take some masking tape. And this is going to do two things. This is going to hold the lid down and give them a sticky surface to climb up and get into the trap. And then tonight, you can take the straw out of your rum and Coke, I'm sorry, rum and Pepsi, and turn the light on. And uh, the ho hopefully, the stink bugs will crawl up the sides, down into the funnel, be attracted by the light, and they'll get down there and they won't be able to get back out. And then what we'll do is take a plastic bag and dump them into that. We'll take the tape off and then dump them into the bag. And then we'll tie them up.